Well, the hayfield's looking quite a bit better. It was chock full of weeds. The new hay is starting to grow well underneath, so I've mulched everything down. Been playing around with the old flail mower. Fortunately, the whole, this whole field that's now mulched down looked just like this over here. Now, that's under, that, that was underseeded with grass seed. You can see it's starting to establish itself, but so much for weed in there. If I don't destroy the weeds, the grass is not going to grow. There's not enough grass to be worth putting the disbine on and trying to bale it. The animals won't even eat that. Mm, garbage. Unfortunately, this whole section was overseeded with wheat. I don't see any wheat. I don't see the rows. I saw a few rows where I was working, a little bit that I'd scattered seed just to use up my last of the seed, but not a single trace of where the planter traveled in here. Uh, we destroy the rest of this too and call that wheat a loss. Not a big deal because I wanted this field for hay. It's the other big field in the distance. That hurts losing that, but I'm not going to destroy it until I've talked with insurance because it it was planted late, but it may be covered. So we see what happens. I'll keep you informed. I'm probably not going to use the flail on that one to because I don't care about protecting it. We'll probably just mow that down. That flail is a little heavy for this tractor. I've been up on two wheels a few times, but the other one's out of commission. It's three point hitch is broken. I haven't had time to fix it. So get this job done, then worry about fixing the other one. <laughs>